Okay, I'm back. I've changed this plate out. Remember in the last uh, segment there, this was the unfinished negative plate. Again, neutral, positive. This one is uh, finished from the factory. I believe that they call it a number two finish. Fairly smooth. This one was the one again I scuffed with the orbital sander using an 80 grit sandpaper. And as you can see I just put it in my solution and uh, aeration started forming on this plate which uh, it's going to be interesting to see what happens when I apply some power to it. Again I'm going to try and just just barely turn the just turn the power on for about a half a second or so. Kind of see maybe where some of the production, at least most of the production, is starting on these plates. And if it seems to continue throughout the rest of the plate. Uh, did you see that? This entire surface here, which measures about a quarter of an inch, instantly started producing gas. Let's see if I can move my camera a bit and get a little better picture here. There we go. Alright, let's try pulsing that power again. Or rather pulsing it this time. On. Off. On. Off. Look at that. Let's zoom out. Maybe we can get a little bit more of the cell here. That's no, not one to zoom. Okay, let's just pan up. There we go. Here's the top of the cell. What I'm noticing now is that the gas bubbles seem to be a little bit larger. They're not as fine as the previous plate that was unsanded. Okay. Let's see, you can take another shot of bottom again. See that? It's almost as if I just lit up that plate. There we go, look at that. Hmm. A lot of questions there I have. And I'm really hoping I can get some answers. I know there's a lot of intelligent people out there, much more so than myself. Really would like to know what's going on here. Alright, I've got one more plate to try. Basically the same plate as I've got here, except for as you can see I've got some... Uh, excuse me. I've got some lines in the plate that uh, I just ran this across the uh, table saw, created some grooves. They, uh, they're probably a few thousandths of an inch deep, uh, very narrow, or excuse me, very shallow grooves. There we go, you can get a better, better view on the edge there. I'm going to go ahead and swap out the plates now, a plate with, uh, with this one and uh, see if we can notice any any formation uh, or at least a, uh, an increase in formation um, along the edges of those grooves. Let's see.